Oh, hello! I guess you're worried about the leave and search geography, yeah? Well, I've got a few things here that might be useful to you. Now, first problem is, the geography is a new syllabus, introduced in 2006. If you were doing your leave and search in the year 2004 or 2005, then I could give you five long question topics, and that's all you'd have to learn. Guaranteed. No chance of getting stung. Handy. It's not like that anymore though. They've changed the course so that there's nearly nothing you can avoid. You have to study nearly every single part of that annoyingly long course. Let's see what we got for you. So higher level first. Higher level geography. In the short questions, they're fairly unpredictable, but I have a list of them here that, you know, are likely to come up. Actually, I couldn't be bothered reading it out. Do you know what? I couldn't be bothered. It's too long. Um, we'll skip to the physical geography section. In the physical geography, you're fairly much guaranteed these things. OS map sketch. Having to discuss river landforms, the impact of humans on rivers, and volcanoes. There. If you're a panicky last minute merchant who hasn't studied much, I'd study those things, and that should be enough to get you through, through the physical. Although, it's a risk. In the regional, um, it is possible that if you know all the sketch maps of the places you've picked, like one European region, one subcontinental region, and Ireland. And if you know how to draw the sketch maps of all those three, then you might be okay to just study, say, all three sketch maps, and then two out of the three. As in, for example, we're studying Ireland, Italy, and India, three eyes. And it is possible that you could get, away, get through your exam by just knowing India, Italy, and how to sketch Ireland. But it's a very risky strategy, I wouldn't recommend it. In the regional, what's most likely to come up is a sketch map of Ireland, or possibly the European region of your choice. Um, also, agriculture in Ireland, tourism in Ireland, and both agriculture and tourism in a subcontinental region and in the European region. Um, other possible topics is culture in the subcontinental region. So, or else possibly um, industry in either the subcontinental region or the European region. So there's your regional. Probably doesn't help much. Economic geography. Your most likely topics there. You probably need to draw a graph or a chart. That's fairly standard. Also, non-renewable energy sources. Location of manufacturing industry. Environmental concerns and multinational companies in general. Possibly an aerial photo sketch. Maybe. The human we don't really do that in our school, but um, I have some predictions made for it anyway. The most likely stuff to come up in the human is an aerial photo sketch, interpreting a graph or a chart, land use theory modules, urban growth in developed economies, and historic settlement on the OS map. There we are. Then, for the options, there's either global interdependence, the geoecology, culture and identity, or else the atmosphere, ocean, environment. I don't know which one you've picked, but I have predictions for them all anyway, so I might as well just go through them. The global interdependence one, I would go for looking at global warming, third world debt, unfair trade. They're the most likely ones to come up this year. If you know those three, you're probably covered for that. Or if you know even one of those three, maybe you'll get lucky. The geoecology option, which, I mean, who would pick that? Do you know what I mean? Like, boring. Really boring. Um, unless of course you're doing ag science or you're a farmer or something, you know, then it might help. Geoecology, firstly, composition or characteristics of a soil type. That's the most likely one. Or else, factors influencing soil formation slash characteristics. Or maybe characteristics of a biome. A biome. The cultural identity option. 
The most likely thing is cultural groups versus nat national borders, as in little cultural cliques like the Basque region in Spain or that kind of crap. Religion and problems caused by religion, or else race and ethnic, eth what's that fucking word? Ethnicity. That's how you say it, isn't it? Ethnicity. Yeah. All right. Um, the atmosphere, ocean, environment option then, this is the one that we do in our school because Eilish loves all that crap. It's one of her favourite things. You have patterns of circulation. Oh, for fuck's sake. Just fucking talk. Patterns of circulation. <laughs> patterns of circulation in the oceans. Water cycle stuff. The interaction of the uh, atmosphere and the ocean. Or climate change. Shut up! Bad dog! There we go. Yeah, that's grand. That's all I got for you. Oh shit, yeah, ordinary level. Mm. For the ordinary level, once again, I have the short questions predicted, but I'm not going to bother reading them out because, you know, you can just go to the information section below and download them from Mediafire. They're all there. Well, geography is there in the information section, the link to the Mediafire download, so just get it there, handy. Um, anyway, a physical geography. OS map sketch, river landforms, impact of humans on rivers, like flooding or something, flood control, and earthquakes. There's your four most likely topics in the physical geography section. Um, for the regional, once again, you should know how to sketch your regions, but here's the most likely things to come up. Um, sketching Ireland should come up. Also, um, agriculture or industry in Ireland. In the um, subcontinental region, you should get industries most likely, or else culture or possibly tourism. For the European region, the most likely thing you're going to get there is culture or else climate, or possibly agriculture. All right, um, economic. To interpret a graph or chart, as in they have a graph and you have to, you know, read information off it, like how high is the bar on the bar chart. Really brain dead, moronic kind of stuff, which is good, you know, it'll make you pass. Um, also, developing economies, very likely. Exploitation of energy resources, and multinational companies in Ireland, specifically. They're your most likely topics there. If you're doing the human geography option, aerial photo sketch, very common, population pyramids, urban problems in developing economies, or possibly settlement patterns on the Ordnance Survey map. And that's it. That's the lot, isn't it? Yeah. That's geography done. Find a way. Take a look at me now. It's all over. Look at me now. I've been oh, going out of my mind, running out oh, of control. It's been a long, lonely road, but I've walked it. I have been told. told you're no good in a system that's wrong. It's been